Hello, I'm Jamie with the Volusia County Public Library. In this video, we are going to explore the basics on how to use WorldBook Online Student Edition, which is for middle school and high school students and parents. Start by opening up the web browser of your choice. We recommend using Google Chrome. Go to the library homepage, volusialibrary.org. Once there, hover over Digital Library, then hover over Research Databases, and click on Databases A to Z. Use the search box to type in World Book Online or click on the W. Then click on World Book Online. If you are using a library computer or library Wi Fi, click on Proceed to World Book. If you are accessing from home, you will be prompted to enter your library card number. No PIN is needed. Here you can see the variety of WorldBook Online products we have access to. For middle school and high school age students, you will want to click on the red and green box with the pencil called Student. The home page offers a variety of articles that you can click on and read. Scroll through them by using the arrows on the right and left sides of the screen. If you scroll down, you can view articles related to current events, access quick links to biographies, and view the featured media of the day. If you have a certain topic you're looking for, you can type it in the search box, for example, Civil War, and click the magnifying glass or hit Enter. As you are typing, a drop-down menu of choices may also appear depending on the topic. You can choose from that as well. From the results, click on the article that looks like it best fits your needs. The article can be read to you by clicking on the speaker icon. You can also change the voice from female to male and make it slower or faster. Along the left-hand side of the screen, you will see the sections of the article. Click on a section to jump to that point and continue reading. On the right side of the screen, we can see that this article includes two tables and additional information, a short video on Abraham Lincoln, and a picture of General Lee. Additional text features are found along the right as you read through the article. Need to cite your source for a project or paper? Scroll down to the bottom and click on How to Cite This Article. Copy and paste the style you need. Check with your teacher for which format to use. Back at the top, you can view the Florida standards this article meets. Media will show you all of the media and text features used in the article. And Related will show you a list of related articles, books, websites, magazine articles, curriculum correlations, and web quests, which are printable worksheets with questions to record your answers as you read and learn. These can be very helpful for at-home learning. We can go back to the article by clicking on the X in the upper left corner. By clicking on the gear, we can view our tools and settings. Of most use in this section, you can save in various ways, including using your Google account. Share by email or through Google Classroom. You can also print and view citations. You can also translate the article as well as change the size of the text. You can also use the menu in the upper left to view different sections of WorldBook Student like the Atlas, the Dictionary, How to Do Research, Interactive Maps, Timelines, and Trivia Quizzes. 
I hope you have enjoyed this beginning introduction to the resources WorldBook Online Student has to offer for teens and their families.